back to our series of top 10 lists where we give you guys super cool, awesome, crazy lists. I'm Court McGinley. We have a rather interesting list for you guys here today. We're gonna to be talking about the top 10 mysterious places in the world. But before we get into all of that, I wanna know what is the most mysterious place you've ever been? Let me know down in the comments. All right, so let's get started. In our number 10 spot, we have Nazca Lines. These lines in the Nazca Desert were created thousands of years ago. When people look down on these lines from the sky, they claim to see many different things. Things that people are claiming to see include animals, people, or various other things that are considered important to the Nazca people. Several scholars have tried to determine the importance of these lines. So far, there are a few theories. One of these being that the Nazca people created them to be seen by their gods in the sky. Next, in at number nine, we have the Bermuda Triangle. Yes, you knew we had to throw this one in. This is a region in the western part of the North Atlantic Ocean, with its apexes in the vicinities of Miami, Bermuda, and Puerto Rico. It covers an estimated 500,000 square miles. It is said that a number of aircraft and ships have disappeared under mysterious circumstances in this region, and they were never seen again. In at number eight, we have Mount Roraima. This mountain is located in Brazil, and it's pretty unusual looking because instead of finishing in a peak like other mountains, this one's top is a rather large plateau. It's thought to be among the world's oldest geological formation, and the fact that this has a flat top was probably the result of winds and rain. The top of this mountain is usually covered in clouds, particularly large amount of endemic species of floral and fauna. Species that can be found nowhere else on the earth. In at number seven, we have Monsell Army Sea Forts. These are located in England and they were built in 1942. Each fort consisted of a cluster of seven buildings surrounding a central command tower. When it was operational, catwalks once connected the buildings. These offshore fortified towers were designed to provide an anti-aircraft fire during the Second World War. After their successful wartime career, the forts were decommissioned in the late 1950s, shortly after the Nor Army Fort was badly damaged in a storm and being struck by a ship. But it was dismantled in 1950 to 1960. In the 1960s and 70s, the remaining abandoned forts were famously taken over by pirate radio stations. The forts are currently slowly decaying, but people still go by on boats and look at them, even though they aren't allowed to enter them. In at number six, we have abandoned power plant MI cooling tower, and this is located in Belgium. This is one of the craziest places I have ever seen. This power plant was originally built in 1921. And even though it's been closed since 2007 and no longer creates electricity, this magnificent cooling tower still looms over the town. The coolest part about this whole place would be the trumpet-like structure in the middle, which introduced hot water to the structure, where it would then be cooled, dripping down hundreds of small concrete slats. In 1977, this power plant was the main source of energy in this area. Apparently, it was able to cool down 480,000 gallons of water per minute. Also, this was one of the largest coal burning plants in Belgium. But throughout the years, it was reported that the plant was responsible for 10% of the total carbon dioxide emission in Belgium. In 2006, Greenpeace brought so much negative attention that a year later, they were closed. In at number five, Socotra. This is a small island in the Indian Ocean. This island looks pretty crazy, you guys, and it's so unique that a third of the plants found there can't be found anywhere else on Earth. Sometime throughout the 90s, a survey was conducted by a team of UN biologists, and it was discovered that nearly 700 endemic species were found here that were not found anywhere else on Earth. In 2001, it was discovered that deep inside a huge cave on the island, a large number of inscriptions, drawings, and archaeological equipment was found. Further evidence shows that it was left by sailors who visited the island between the 1st century BC and the 6th century AD. Experts have described the island as being the most alien looking place on Earth. In at number four, we have Pripyat, Ukraine. The now abandoned city was located in northern Ukraine, and it was once home to more than 50,000 people. But once Chernobyl nuclear disaster hit in 1986, the whole city was left deserted, and it's been that way ever since due to radiation. In the 1970s, the town was less than three kilometers away from the reactor and was constructed for the plant's workers. All 50,000 people who lived in this town were evacuated 36 hours after the accident. This truly does look like a ghost town, because due to being abandoned, it currently has as trees are growing through broken windows and grass growing up through cracks in the ground. The town is currently unfit for human habitation and it will continue to be for hundreds of years to come. In at number three, we have the underwater city in Lion City, China, also known as China's Atlantis. Pretty amazing. Here we have an incredible city that is located 130 feet underwater. The city just so happens to be 1,341 years old and it is located in eastern China, between the Five Lion Mountains. The city was fully submerged in 1959 during the construction of the Xenan River hydropower station. What happened was the government decided the city needed a new hydroelectric power station. 
so they built a man-made lake. However, after building the dam, the town slowly filled with water until it was completely submerged. Seeing as it's underwater, it's being pretty well preserved, and it's relatively in good condition. This city, even though it is underwater, it's still comprised of a maze of white temple memorial arches, paved roads, and houses. And at number two, we have the door to hell. This one's really interesting. After all, a never-ending flame is quite an interesting thing to see. This was actually made back in 1971 by a geologist, believe it or not. A team of Russian scientists discovered the site. Then it was believed to be a large oil and gas field. The scientists decided that they would set up a drilling rig, but something went horribly wrong. Luckily, no lives were lost during this incident. Now we're left with this crazy hellish pit of fire. All right, so we talked about some pretty mysterious places already, but Bringing it in at the number one spot, we have the Nine Hells of Beppu. This is located in Japan on the island Kyushu. The Nine Hells is popular among the people in Japan, but is almost unknown to foreigners. Not gonna lie, before this list, I didn't know it existed. This is, however, a beautiful spot to visit if you're traveling to this specific area. This is an island that offers a lot of things that you wouldn't be able to find anywhere else. One of them being all natural ponds that are different colors. The fact that each of these nine ponds are different colors is pretty rare. The minerals that are in each of these ponds are correlated to different colors, which makes this site not just unique, but mysterious and amazing. Well, there you guys have it, our top 10 list of mysterious places in the world. Let me know down in the comments which one you found to be the most mysterious. Also, as always, please let me know down in the comments which top 10 list you would like to see me do next time. Have a great day and I'll see you guys all in the next one. So make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment, tell friends and family. We have more top 10 lists over this way. And you guys can follow me on Instagram at Court McGinley. Just went on a great trip, so follow me and check out my pics.